Hello guys, it's Michael here from Mixing Mango and yeah, welcome to this uh, little video that I've got for you today. Yeah, I know guys, I'm really sorry that I haven't had any videos out recently, like literally the last five or six videos on the channel have been Josh, but yeah, I've just been really busy with exams and stuff and just revision and, and I just haven't had time to do any videos or render any videos or play Scape in general really. But yeah, I'm, I'm going to be having a nice, as we've, in England we've actually got a free day, um, May weekend this weekend so it is a nice little three day weekend so I'll hopefully get on and I'll play some more skate this weekend hopefully get some drops because we're deciding to go either Nex or KK tomorrow and Sunday so yeah that's pretty cool so yeah let's get into the video guys so yeah what I wanted to talk about was my opinions on the recent um, update that they did on Tuesday now <clears throat> I was kind of first hand to this like I have to say Tuesday I was pretty angry um, for a number of reasons. Um, so on Tuesday, if you didn't know, they bought out a a like a stats buff. They also bought out a couple of nerfs of some stuff they wanted to nerf, and they also like mixed up so that the the, the combat triangle will be more useful when you're fighting bosses and stuff. And then they also bought out hard mode God Wars. So yeah, I think I think I'll talk about hard war, uh, hard mode God Wars dungeon first. So yeah, so. I did not enjoy it. Uh, we went for one trip with Josh Duo. We got about 10 kills and then we ran out of food. But the problem with hard uh, mode is it is pretty hard. Like, yeah, it's not like really hard like KK where you can just insta death. But, you know, it, there is a chance of dying and that is kind of annoying. But the most annoying thing, I think this is the most annoying thing definitely, is the fact that the drops aren't increased. Like, I'm not even joking. Ten kills should at least get me one decent thing. I thought if I'm gonna fight a harder boss, which I can't camp and I can't solo and I can't duo, I have to go in like teams or something. Then surely, surely I should um, be getting better drops. But no, and I watched a couple of live streams as well, and they weren't getting any drops. So mm, my overall review and my just personal feelings is hard mode God Wars was a bit rushed. Even Mod Crisell even said that he wanted to bring out armors with the um, with the new hard mode, but they didn't have enough time because they rushed it too much, which is you know it's kind of annoying. But I think I'll live with that because I'll probably just stick to stuff like KK Nex and just normal God Wars really. So yeah, so the second thing that um, probably I should talk about next is okay. Yeah, I'll talk about the 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 buff, uh, the nerf on some uh, weapons and armor. So yeah, so basically they nerfed Torva a lot, really hard apparently. They also nerfed Drygors and a couple of other things like so yeah. According to a source which is unidentified, aka Josh, <laughs> he um he said apparently that Torva like halved in price because it was basically only a bit better than Ban and people were so annoyed that this amazing armor Torva, which should be the second best armor in the game behind Port's armor technically, was not that good and yeah, people were so annoyed by this. I think, um, I'm not sure what Jagex does, do they ever test their games, like it's kind of crazy how like they don't realize how bad these uh, armors are when they take them out but yeah apparently also on the release day Torax and stuff was actually better than Bandos which is kind of silly because Bandos is <coughs> yeah sorry about that someone just came into my room so yeah what was I saying yeah it's just kind of crazy how they don't test out these new armors and stuff so the next thing which really annoyed me was the Drygors nerf so yeah on the day release Drygors were useless literally C Maul the Chaotic Maul was actually pretty much as good as the Drygors and plus with all the little abilities you can do with the Seamall it probably was even better but since then they've taken the accuracy up or like they say the increased chance of actually hitting has been increased or something like that so it's not a proper nerf buff but yeah that's pretty cool um yeah I like that um <laughs> I have to say like I'm not a huge fan of the idea that Drygors aren't the amazing weapon they used to be but yeah it's pretty cool so yeah, I've got two more things I wanted to quickly review. Um, basically, the first one was the nerf to penance and soul split. These two really annoyed me. I don't, who complained about penance? Honestly, guys, it was it wasn't that overpowered. You only had it for one hour. I thought it was amazing. So, Jagex, don't fix something that's not broken. As for soul split, 
like yeah they nerfed it loads loads of people are saying yeah it's terrible now but i haven't seen that much of a difference and to be honest with the new combat they've made bandos so easy he hardly ever hits his 2k's and his 1k's which is you know that's pretty good it just makes it generally easier which is you know pretty cool and good to solo so yeah i'm not too annoyed about that but i am annoyed about penance so the last thing i wanted to talk about was just next like honestly how can you test a game? I'm not gonna like have a go at Jagex like really badly, but how can you test a game and not realise there are six Nexus in the room and spawn at the same time? Because that was a glitch that was happening on release date. So you know, it's just kind of crazy um, how they can do that really. But yeah, um, coming to the end of this video, <laughs> I actually kind of gone over the um, the timer of how long I wanted the video to be. But you know, it wasn't a too long video. I just wanted to explain some of my views on the recent update and yeah I'm going to try and get some more videos out so I'm going to pre-record some this weekend so that I've got more of um, my stuff on the channel rather than just all Josh because uh, it's a bit Josh central at the moment so yeah that's pretty cool and yeah thanks for watching guys and goodbye